Hey guys, my name is Tom Vaughn, and uh, I just wanted to show you guys the dress shoe that I'm using for flying with. Um, I worked at a regional airline for two years, almost two years, and fractional private jet job for a couple months now. And uh, just coming up on two years of use um, full time. So uh, yeah, here they are, the lens uh, that's called, the shoe company is called Lens nine to five so this is my old shoe after two two years a little worn out there on the uh the ball area um and then there's it's scuffed a lot right here because uh on the crj there's it i would just rub i don't know i would like kind of grab the yoke tree thing with my heels for some reason and they got scuffed up Another wear spot was inside the shoe. Um, I guess my heel sort of rides towards the inside of my step or something. So it wore through the leather on the inside, which never really caused any discomfort. Um, yeah, but a little bit on the outside too, cause I guess they're just so wide, but like, again, it's super comfortable and it never felt like my heel was floating. It just sort of wore into the side over the course of the two years. And then they clean up real nicely. At the airport back in the day when we, when there were shoe shiners, you know, these would clean up real nice. And then now that I'm in and out of FBOs, a lot of them have those little things you push the button or turn the thing and it spins the, the cleaner thing. And then here is my new pair, Lens. Um, yeah, so there you go, brand spanking new. They're not like the fanciest dress shoe. You know, I wouldn't recommend these for an interview, but but for just uh, working, it's great because uh, it's almost like a sneaker, but it looks still formal enough. You know, um, it's a zero drop, so you you know it's supposed to be better for your body or whatever. You know, thinner, kind of a thinner. Uh, not, a, not a ton of cushion, so if you're looking for maximum cushion, this is not it. This is more of a minimalist, uh, but it's kind of, it's so li super lightweight and it compacts down kind of in your luggage. You don't really have to worry about it. And then I've got a really wide uh, foot, so it has a really super wide toe box, which makes for, you know, just a lot of comfort in your walking and standing and just to be in. Um, again, not, not fa super fancy with one of those tall pointy toes, but I find it's kind of nice, you know, in an airplane, you're, you're getting in and out of the cockpit and going up and down like uh, slippery, icy stairs on the jetway or uh, doing whatever. And you, you don't want like extra things hanging off that can get snagged. So it's, I find it's really, really um, practical for uh, your day-to-day -day work use in and out of airplanes, um, keeping, keeping everything compact and kind of like the where you need it. And uh, yeah, so, so I think really lightweight, super comfortable. The laces, uh, there was a comment on their website, one of the reviews said the laces wear out super fast. I don't find that to be the case. These, I, got, I had an extra set of laces just in case that happened, but the laces lasted for two, two years, uh, didn't break. I mean, it wore, wore a little bit in the spot I tied it, that's about it. For a while, I was only wearing these to work, and then I, my only other set of uh, footwear that I had with me in my bag were flip-flops and you definitely don't want to walk in flip-flops for too long uh, if you wanted to do like a, a good walk downtown somewhere so uh, like I would you know example that I've used these in Oregon we stayed at a hotel a little bit outside of downtown and uh, there was this awesome trail that went along the river there that went all the way to the downtown area where all the breweries are and the restaurants and and so I just wore these and they're awesome. It's like kind of almost, I mean, you can kind of almost hike in these. I mean, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't recommend hiking too intensely cause like you don't want to like really scuff up and get these all dusty and dirty if you don't have a way of cleaning that. But, um, but yeah, so really love this shoe. Uh, if you guys have a shoe kind of like this where it's a minimalist and like, you know, offers that comfort and, and function as well as looking maybe even a little bit nicer than this let me know in the comments because maybe the next time i'll try out something different but right now i'm sticking with these 
Uh, I know there's a few, there's like one or two other options I've seen, but a lot of times they're like really expensive. Um, I mean, you know, $180, $200 or so. These are like a hundred. Usually you can find like a 25% off deal and get these for like a hundred bucks. And uh, they do offer a military discount. I think that also might be 25%, might be 15, I don't remember. And, uh, um, and then more recently, I've been wearing these for work and then I pack their, um, these are the nine to five, and then I pack the Lems Primal 2, uh, which is just their minimalist uh, sneaker or like trainer shoe, kind of looks like a, like a New Balance minim Minimus or something. Um, also has that wide toe box, but it's mesh, so it breathes really nicely. Um, they look good, they're comfortable. So I wear those, or, you know, around town and they pack down super, super uh, small, so it's really convenient in that way. So, uh, so yeah, the Lems, man, I, this is actually my, I've got like four or five pairs of Lems. So yeah, I really like Lems. Uh, they're really an awesome shoe. So let me know what you guys think. If you've tried these or if you've tried one of uh, maybe a better option or something, uh, let me know. Also for the record, not sponsored in this video, uh, but hey, maybe that'll change if you guys all start buying some of these shoes and I'll be like one of those cool sponsored pilot guys that gets for cool free swag from these companies. So 